Yeah, so we have a 2019 CRF 250R for sale. Sorry if you hear wind in the background. But I wanted to walk you through the bike, let you hear it run. Um, so I'll do a little quick walkthrough. Give you the information I have to the best of my knowledge. Um, first and foremost, this was raced by a guy named Jordan Jones. Um, he had a mechanic and uh, it sounds like a lot of different... Uh, sponsors that would help him take care of the bike and get him ready to go um, he did just change the top end so you'll see here he has an hour meter on it so the 64.6 is the total hours on the bike 64.6 is the bottom end and 5.3 on the top end so 5.3 hours on the top end of this bike uh, you'll see it has precision work suspension. You can do your research to find out what that is, but it's basically this coating, as well as some other things like the springs. Uh, that's the signature blue coating. Looks pretty cool. Same goes for the back. You can see that there. Different spring, not the factory spring there either. O-ring chain. Stock exhaust except for the headers. You'll see there's the FMF power bomb headers. It does have a full Hinson clutch, but it has the stock Honda cover. So in there you will find the Hinson clutch basket, springs, pads, all that stuff. Oil was changed every race. He had this for I think about five or six months, something like that. Air filter does need to be changed because he had just raced it um, and didn't clean it because we were going to trade or just clean it yourself. Um, it does have three different um, mappings, so you can go from like I think it's eco or like uh, standard if you press this button again it goes to two blinks and that would make it um, kind of like a little bit faster and then they have the aggressive mode which is three blinks electric start which is pretty sweet you'll see that here overall it's a clean bike looks good well taken care of 2019 I don't know if I've missed anything else. Looks like Tusk brake lever. I don't know if that's factory or not. It does have his wrap on it, so you could remove that and get back to the stock CRF 250. It does come with this, the factory headers in case you wanted to replace them. You lose a little bit of power from what I understand, but not too much. Looks like I have to put the seat back on. I don't know if I, yeah, I have it on, that's fine. Yeah, let's go ahead and let her start. It is cold, so you can see I'm holding the pipe here. There's absolutely no heat on it. I'm not gonna pull the clutch or the fast idle, which is on a fuel injected motor. You'll see that little knob up there the yellow knob you pull that out it acts as a choke but this is a fuel injected 250 so let's go ahead and uh, give it a start see if it all right so I could have probably used the fast idle to get it started quicker but it is running good
purrs like a kitten. The reason he got rid of this bike is he actually went back to racing 450s. He's a cool dude. Had a lot of conversation with him about this bike and the 450. But I did have his 450 before this, and that's the reason he reached out. So he was uh, injured, I guess, and ended up going with a 250 to kind of rehabilitate over the last six months. And then uh, he was going to get a 450. He offered it uh, for trade for his 450 back that I had, and now I have his 250. And uh, I feel like they're per pretty equal in value. You know, newer bike, electric start, some nice suspension on this thing. Um, whereas the 450 was two years older, kickstart, still a nice bike, but it had about a hundred and some hours on it, he told me, uh, total, but he did have about 40 hours on the top end on that bike. He did change the top end, as I mentioned, and he told me that the, uh, the stock piston was clean as hell, like he didn't, he didn't have to do it, but they just do it for maintenance purposes make sure the bike's always tip top. And you do really notice a difference when you change the mapping. So I'll show you that real quick in case you're not familiar. Press that button. Let me know if you have any questions. Take care.